two error types tested in this question one modifier and the second one is tense let's do a vertical scan of the five answer options look at this the entire sentence is underlined if you take a quick look you'll realize that a and c have one type of construct right the structure of these two sentences reporting a 90 percent drop in income something is presented there is a comma here so it looks it appears as if we are talking about a modifier followed by some information Look at the construct of the remaining three answer choices. In all the remaining three, B, D, and E, we'll see a semicolon here, which essentially means that this entire information has been divided into two independent clauses. Let's check out which makes sense. Let's start with answer option A. Reporting a 90% drop in net income during the second quarter. Dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales appears in between the two commas. So it's basically a parenthetical expression. So let's bracket it. We can even ignore it for the time being. It essentially is giving us a rational, a cause for the drop in net income. So let's forget it for the time being and see whether it makes sense. Reporting a 90% drop in net income during the second quarter, the earnings guidance for the year was withdrawn by BESCO. The moment you see a modifier, the obvious question that we're going to be asking is who or what was reporting a 90% drop? The company was reporting a 90% drop. The company here is Best Buy Co. So Best Buy Co should have been the word that is placed next to this modifier. Whereas we have the earnings guidance here. So it's a misplaced modifier error. The word that should be modified by the modifier is not placed next to the modifier. So A can be eliminated on account of misplaced modifier. Here we should have had Best Buy Co. While we are at this, we'll quickly move to answer choice C. We'll look at B subsequently because C, the construct is akin to A. Let's see if C makes sense. Reporting a 90% drop in net income during the second quarter and dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales, Best Buy Co. did something. So who was reporting a 90% drop? Best, guy, Best Buy Co. was reporting a 90% drop. So to that extent, for this part, it is absolutely right. Let's read the sentence once more to see whether the entire thing makes sense. Reporting a 90% drop in net income during the second quarter and dragged down by restructuring. We are talking about something else also happening. Dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales. Who or what was dragged down? When we are using an and here, we are talking about two events, right? The first one, it's reporting 90% drop. Second one, it was dragged down by restructuring charges. What was that it referring to? It is referring to Best Buy Co. So we are saying Best Buy Co was dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales. We probably colloquially when you are saying, we'll use that. We'll say that this company was dragged down by something. Can a company be dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales? The net income of the company can be, the profit of the company can be, the net worth of the company can be, but the company itself cannot be dragged down by restructuring charges and weak sales. Therefore, it is incorrect. Ideally, what we would have wanted is, we would have wanted this part of the construct to reflect the way, to be presented the way it was given in answer option A. If it had had a comma, it would have been a parenthetical expression giving us a cause for why the income dropped. By having an and, it basically makes it as a list of two things. One thing happened for Best Buy and the second thing also happened for Best Buy. The second thing is dragging down. It's dragging down Best Buy. What was dragging down Best Buy? It's restructuring charges and weak sales. That is not making sense. So answer option C can be eliminated. What we'd have wanted is this to be a parenthetical expression. By making an and, it has become a listing of things. So it leaves us with three answer options, B, D, and E. The first difference I'm spotting is basically in the tense. We are saying is reporting, has reported, and is reporting. So in two cases, we have used it in the present progressive, and in one instance, we have used it in the present perfect. Let's quickly run through the second part of it, right? In the second part, it says that the company has also withdrawn in two of these options. The company also withdrew in one of these options. In either case, we are talking about an event that has happened just recently or an event that is over. The company has also, also means the company has done one thing and another thing. And both these things, it has done and completed doing it. What was the one thing? It has withdrawn its earnings. What is the second thing the company reported? So it essentially means that the reported is a completed event. In answer option B and in E, it is saying company is reporting. In the present progressive, it means that the event is happening right now. But the second part with the also clearly indicates that the reporting as an event should have got completed. So is reporting is incorrect use of tense. So you can eliminate choices B and D. Choice D is the correct answer to this question. Before you leave, do three things. One, sign up as a trial user for GMAT online course, Visa course GMAT online course at wzko.in slash core. Get started with statistics and average. Get momentum to your GMAT preparation. Pay and convert it into a paid user to get access to the remaining topics. Two other things that you can do. One, subscribe to this channel, youtube.com slash Visaco and turn on notification. Lastly, there is one other thing that you can do. You can join as a member of this channel which is different from subscribing to this channel. 
There's a small monthly fee to pay to join as a member. You get some member only perks which are not available for all subscribers. Click on the join button. Even before you pay, you'll get a listing of the member only perks. Those member only perks will help give a boost to your GMAT preparation. Best wishes.